Not only does Britney Spears have her marriage to Sam Asghari to celebrate, but the pair has a new Calabasas mansion to call home, and the newlyweds are already packed up to move. While Brit has spent a handful of years living in her sprawling Thousand Oaks estate, even throwing her recent wedding there, she and her new hubby are reportedly moving onto a nearly 12,000 square foot mansion, which is located pretty close to where her ex Kevin Federline lives with their two sons. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own, Please, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Britney Spears, aka the Princess of Pop, needs no introduction. And recently, this former teen icon celebrated her love to longtime boyfriend Sam Asghari with an intimate wedding at her Thousand Oaks property. Despite spending most of her time holed up in this mansion, which she purchased back in 2015, it seems that along with the new marriage came an address change. After Brit earned some of her financial freedom back post conservatorship, she and her new hubby had had been spotted house hunting in LA, even checking out Jeffree Star's former mega home. Finally, the two are on the move, and this time it's to a new $11.8 million spread in Calabasas, not too far from where Britney's ex-husband and sons are living. Hey guys, it's Kara the Vampire Slayer, back with another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment, in this one looking at the brand new home of Britney Spears. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit me up on Instagram to chat, and now let's get into this video. In June 2022, it's been reported after a few months of house hunting that Britney Spears and her newlywed husband Sam Asghari have found a new place to call home and are already on the move. Located in the exclusive community of the Oaks in Calabasas, California, Britney has dropped $11.8 million on a mansion that's equipped with a ton of security and privacy, also situated on 1.6 acres of land. Not only is the mansion itself protected, the Oaks is a gated community within another guard gated community. Community. Some other celebrities who call this lavish area home are Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker. And apparently also not too far from here is none other than Brit's ex Kevin Federline and the home that he lives at with their two sons, Sean and Jaden. Just after their intimate wedding, the couple was spotted moving into the new home with Brit's white Mercedes in the driveway along with some moving truck. The move might explain why Brittany and Sam didn't leave for a honeymoon right after their wedding. As for how her ex K-Fed feels about the move, Move, a source claimed Kevin was surprised that of all the neighborhoods she can afford to move to, she chose his. As long as his peace and tranquility aren't invaded as a result, more power to her. Built in 2008, Britney's new mansion seems to be decked out in the usual opulent fashion, which she's a fan of. In fact, I can definitely see a lot of similarities in this home with her Thousand Oaks place. The sprawling single level home boasts 11,649 square feet of space and tall custom steel doors open into a luxury and glam 33 foot front foyer. Much like the spot Britney loves to post videos dancing in at her current mansion, this new entryway offers soaring ceilings, open space, polished stone floors, and a sparkling chandelier. Interiors offer up six bedrooms and nine bathrooms throughout, along with details like imported onyx, hardwood floors, vaulted ceilings, arched hallways, designer mosaic tiles, and much more. The bright main hallways look as if they're out of a palace, while common areas like the formal dining room and great room offer all of the ornate aesthetic that Brit loves so much. There are also hand carved fireplaces throughout, one of which is situated in the main area that combines a family room with a massive kitchen and windowed breakfast nook in an open concept. The gourmet kitchen, where Brit's hubby Sam will likely be cooking her up some meals, offers top grade appliances, an oversized center island, and some more glitzy chandeliers. Also, the family room here opens up to a 2,000 square square foot entertainment patio with barbecue center and fireplace to easily take any party outside. Nearby, there's also an elegant wood paneled study and elsewhere a lounge fitted with a wet bar and even a room just for gift wrapping. Considering Brit spends so much time at her current property, an abundance of amenities isn't exactly a bad thing. There's also a wine cellar within the mansion and an extravagant 10 seat home theater top notch surround sound. Of course, the princess of pop needs a master suite fit for royalty, and this 
this new one, it doesn't skimp out. Her bedroom boasts a fireplace, sitting area, terrace, exercise room, and an extremely lavish attached bath and dual walk-in closets. In fact, the ensuite is decked out in marble with both a soaking tub and steam shower, a vanity, a small TV, and more. While her custom closet looks as if it's a luxury boutique, featuring custom walnut cabinets. Aside from the expansive terrace attached to the mansion, the resort-style grounds pack in a stunning 55-foot pool and spa, complete with waterfalls and even a water slide. For when guests come to stay, Brit's property also has a separate one-bed, one-bath guest house with its own kitchen and elsewhere a five-car garage. Before moving on to this new mansion, Brittany had been living at her beloved Thousand Oaks mansion, which she purchased in 2015 for $7.4 million. Situated on nearly 21 acres of land, this mansion boasted park-like grounds to roam on to say the least. With that kind of space, it's no wonder the pop star held her recent wedding here. Her estate is perched on top of a hill in a gated enclave with a villa-style mansion spanning over 13,200 square feet centering the property. Everything about Brittany's home is grand, with a marble-floored entryway stepping directly down into her lobby-sized great room with a ton of windows, 35-foot high ceilings, and a huge fireplace. This space is hard to miss since it's been featured as the backdrop on her Instagram posts time and time again. The massive entryway features a grand staircase which leads to an open concept second floor area that overlooks that great room, but there's also an elevator to travel around the home. As I mentioned before, Britt loves to dance in her spacious foyer too, as her followers would definitely know. Some spaces to explore include five bedrooms, 7.5 baths, an oak paneled library with views of the Santa Monica Mountains, and a huge media games room. There are multiple common spaces in Brittany's home, including a center island kitchen with top of the line appliances and a casual dining nook with bay windows and fireplace. One formal living room has a classic glam aesthetic featuring a crystal chandelier and limestone fireplace. Brittany's also fixed herself a complete home gym in her mansion, the same one that she nearly burned to the ground at one point. Here, her master suite is also fit for a queen. Her private and massive bedroom comes complete with a private terrace, two custom walk-in closets, and two luxurious bathrooms, one with a jetted tub and one with a steam shower. So which one of these suites seems to be better? This one? or the one at her new place. The guests in the family bedrooms round out the upstairs level of this mansion. Once Brittany settled into her Thousand Oaks home, the home quickly became her go-to setting for many of her favorite activities like dancing, painting, and showing off her home workout. Only time will tell if she spends that much time at her new place too. Outside, the impressive features continue, including 1,200 square feet of patio space, an infinity pool and spa, and a tennis court and charming golf course. Elsewhere, there's an orchard and more landscaped grounds surrounding the place. There is even a sprawling poolside pavilion with its own full kitchen, bathroom, and wine cellar. Before packing up to move to Calabasas, Brittany and Sam celebrated their nuptials, hosting an intimate wedding at her Thousand Oaks mansion in June 2022. The surprise wedding was complete with about 60 guests, including celebrity friends of Brittany, such as Madonna, Paris Hilton, Selena Gomez, Drew Barrymore, Ansel Elgort, and Donatella Versace, who also designed Britt's $20,000 wedding dress. It was reported that Britt and Sam didn't have a first dance together, but Spears danced with some of her famous girlfriends to her hit song Toxic and sang her guest and friend Paris Hilton's single Stars Are Blind. Meanwhile, Britt's first and very brief husband, Jason Alexander, who she married for 55 hours in 2004, attempted to crash the wedding. He streamed video on Instagram Live before the ceremony, reportedly from the inside of her property before being arrested arrested, and booked for trespassing, vandalism, and battery. Aside from that minor hiccup, the newlyweds managed to have a beautiful ceremony. Britt told Vogue about the aesthetic for the day that she wanted to have a small and beautiful moment with family and friends, opting for warm and feminine colors like blush, white, cream, and gold. The front of Britt's Thousand Oaks mansion was decked out in roses, while a white horse with golden hooves and a carriage pulled up for the couple outside. Well, I think it's safe to say that if those are some of Britt's final memories at her longtime Thousand Oaks estate, then they're pretty good ones. But that about wraps up our Britney Spears and Sam Asghari house tour. What did you think about the Paw Princess's brand new Calabasas estate? What about their wedding? Be sure to let me know down in the comments. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you all in another video. Bye.